Hi guys, welcome to my new acrylic pouring tutorial and today I will use very unusual for me color palette it will be quite soft earthy tones and the first color I use for the base is titanium white and this is Naples yellow red light and I will link in the description all the colors I use so please check it out for more information And this is main base color, warm grey. I think I had too much color at the bottom, so I just move the extra color to the top just like this and of course i need to cover all the edges of the painting with the same color The first color for the flow I use is pearl white and this is gold by PPO. This is burnt sienna by Amsterdam and burnt amber. Copper of course it's perfect for this color palette and more Naples yellow red light on the top. Let's torch the paint and blow it out. Oh, very beautiful colors. Let's work with the details now. Here some gold is all mixed with white. I try to fix it. And today I want to use only my breath to work with the details. No swipes again. I think at the top there is still less contrast. I will try to improve it. Blowing out once more the same colors and even more.
it worked out well so let's see what I can do with the right side of the top I want to remove extra paint here I'm still not really pleased with the right top part and now it's getting even more water I will try to add here more contrast like I did it before And here we go now. So the last touch-ups and let's see how it will dry. My painting is dry and I'm really happy about the colors, but not so happy with the composition. I think at the bottom, right bottom, there is too much negative space and all the flow to this place to the left side so I want to add one more little detail to this corner and let's see if it can help there are same colors but of course I cannot add them in the same order because here I have no split base with white but let's see This is not what I really expected. Let's try one more time. I add more base color near as you see to help the colors moving better now it's very important and here I decided to use even overleft paint just to add more paint to the canvas well I hope this time it will work And now it's really beautiful, I like it. Just a little bit more spreading the base color over the canvas to avoid a clear boundary between layers of paint. And now let's jump to the next step. The painting is dry and I want to show you guys how I cover it with epoxy resin. I spread the resin with my hands because this is more comfortable for me for me it's easier to understand if there's parts not covered yet because I just can feel it
and after spreading the resin on the canvas I make sure that all the edges are totally covered too let's touch the resin because there's lots of bubbles now The finishing is ready, let me show you the final result. So here it is dry and covered with two layers of epoxy resin and I'm really in love with this color palette. Earthy tones are just mesmerizing. Oh, maybe this is a coffee with milk? What do you think? What associations do these tones evoke in you? Please let me know in the comments. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more videos like that. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next video. Bye bye.